Tri-Fi Audio Company Culus has announced a new DAC. Now, this is the MUB1. It's uh, it's coming with a quad, quad DAC setup uh, inside of the unit. You are getting four Cyrus Logic CS43131 DAC chips inside. Um, you also will have four BUF634 amp chips for a proper balanced headphone uh setup like you 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 you'll have a lot of power with this particular DAC amplifier it will work with not only IEMs but also with with your with with headphones overhead headphones now because it's this modern DAC there is support for Bluetooth there is Bluetooth connectivity on it you get LDAC support, there is Aptex HD, there is SPC, there is AAC. You have a lot uh, to, to benefit with this unit. Uh, another thing here is the fact that it, it can last long. Battery life on it is very good. It is expensive. It's $500. I don't think uh, most people will rush for it because it's a bit expensive. $500 is not something people really spend on DAC amplifiers immediately, except they're already experienced in the audio game and they want to spend the money and get it. The Qlus MUB1 um, has a lot to offer in terms of power output. You get 1,100 milliwatts which is more than enough for any IEM, any IEM in the world, literally. If if you need this kind of power, you certainly will have to be pairing it up as well with headphones. It will, it will be sufficient for almost any dynamic driver headphone. Even many planar headphones will work perfectly with this small DAC unit. You will have issues powering many headphones out there. Build quality is fantastic. It supports high res audio at 32, 384 kilohertz. There is native DSD 256 signal support. You have two connections, uh, two connections. Uh, you have 3.5 millimeter single ended connection. You have 4.4 millimeter balanced connections as well. That's the two connections you, you get. There is, uh, there is also an OLED uh, kind of like that you get a sort of an OLED display uh, that basically the, the display just showcases different functions uh, such as the active streaming bit rate, your battery life, your gain level um, and the battery on it is quite quite big. You're looking at 2500 milliamp battery life um, sorry, battery inside. So it's good. It's definitely good. It's not the best, but it's good enough for the most part. Five hundred dollars is the price tag. I do believe many people that want to test the DAC for the very first time, they can get themselves the Culus MUB One, test it out and see if if it's something that suits your need. But the only thing there is because it's the five hundred dollar price tag. Uh, if you buy it, then you have to end up keeping it for a long, long time. Uh, many people won't want to buy this and think of any change anytime soon. Um, that is it. Do subscribe to the channel. Uh, although I will drop details, uh, even where you can purchase it down below. Do subscribe to the channel. Do like our content. I'll see you guys very much next time.